the hidden dangers of Roblox every parent should know about. Hello guys, welcome back to Blocks Fire Insight. Today, we will look at the hidden dangers of Roblox every parent should know about. So keep on watching to find out. Before we start, I would like you to hit that red subscribe button so that you never miss out on any of our videos. What is Roblox about? Roblox is a fast online platform where kids can create and interact in what its makers describe as immersive 3D worlds. Players are given the opportunity to create an avatar or player for themselves and allowed a small amount of digital money to rent a house. Money to furnish and decorate the house requires real-world money, with costs adding up fast. A variety of different outfits are also available to purchase, which is a huge draw card for many young children who wants to make their avatar look as cool as possible. Players who don't buy upgrades may be mocked by other players and pressured into spending more. Bullying One of the biggest dangers in Roblox is bullying. This likely isn't surprising to hear, sadly. Today's kids are overconnected. They have smartphones and laptops and tablets. They have social media accounts and gaming profiles. Bullying no longer just takes place in the schoolyard. It takes place everywhere kids are connected to kids. Bullying on Roblox therefore has become a problem that some kids face. Kids give out their username to other kids so they can interact on the platform. They play games together, compete challenges, build houses. Unfortunately, these avenues for bonding on the platform can easily be used for bullying. Kids can say mean things to other kids, encourage bad behavior, and a number of other online bullying techniques kids can use these days. Yes, Roblox monitors the chat for inappropriate images and words, but there are many mean messages that can be exchanged and overlooked. Exposure to inappropriate content. Throughout the online gaming world, wherever games are marketed to children, online predators lurk. Social games like this one are often used as a platform to lure children away from the game and onto other platforms, for example, Facebook, Snapchat, and even in some cases, Skype. Roblox appeals directly to children under 12, easy targets who lack the ability to discriminate between appropriate and inappropriate requests. The game invites players to explore imaginary worlds of all kinds. Some of these are sexual in nature. One British dad who decided to check out the game his son were obsessed with was shocked to discover avatars having virtual sex, ABC News reported in 2017. The chat function poses a real danger to children playing this popular game, explained why safe psychologist Jordan Foster, a leading cyber expert at Family Home. With limited safety measures embedded within the game, children are open for predators to communicate with. Consider it similar to sending a child out into a real room filled with strangers with no barriers in place to stop people being able to talk to whomever they like well. For this reason, Ms. Foster regards Roblox as unsafe for children under the age of 12 and possibly older children as well. Parental controls and other safety features First and foremost, make sure that your child's registrations in Roblox includes an accurate birth date. This will enable automatic filtering and other protections specifically designed to protect children under the age of 13. Being that, Roblox primarily consists of user-created content, the Roblox team has integrated a variety of parental controls directly to its setting which is further explored in its parents' guide. Roblox parental controls give parents the ability to curate the content their kids may encounter when playing, including options to restrict voice chat only to approve friends and turn it off entirely. Create a white list of age-appropriate games for your kids and more. You can learn how to enable those controls here. But that's not all. Roblox also allows your kid to block and report annoying or disruptive players. Make sure they know how to do so. Of course, this also creates an opportunity to have a discussion about online etiquette, which frankly shouldn't be all that different than how you teach them to behave offline. Do unto others as you would have them do unto you goes a long way. Another basic internet safety rules is to never share personal information or password online, no matter what. Concerned about the amount of time or money your child spends on playing Roblox? Whichever device your child uses to play Roblox, there are a variety of settings you can activate, including restrictions on how much money your child can spend. Some parental tools like Microsoft Family Settings, Apple Screen Time, and Google Family Link provide the ability to control exactly when or how long your child is permitted to play games to make sure they get their homework done and don't stay up past their bedtime playing Roblox. That's all for today. I hope you liked the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel so that you never miss any fantastic video from us.